All right. So the first one is the digestive system. Now, I've read hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of books based on the digestive system to understand what high cholesterol meant, which really led me to the discovery of a whole lot more based on how powerful food is. Cool or cool? So the first thing though, that I ever read about the digestive system is that over how much? 70%. Over 70% of your immune system lies within your digestive system. So think about that for a minute. Over 70% of your immune system lies within your digestive system. Your immune system is what keeps you alive. So if over 70% of your immune system is in your digestive system, shouldn't we be more concerned with the food we put in? Yes or yes? Yes. Yeah. So uh, based on the allergy question, allergies are an autoimmune dysfunction. So based on how strong you make your immune system really goes a long way with the allergy issues. So we can talk more about that. So with the digestive system, now, if you read the books, it's very, very scientific, very confusing, but after a little while, it starts to make sense. Where what we're talking about are two things. How many things? Two. Two. Two main functions of the digestive system. The first one is to pull nutrients from the foods we eat. To pull nutrients from the foods we eat. And the second is to kill off bad bacteria. Those are the two main functions of our digestive system. Cool or cool? Cool. Okay. Now, I'd love to go in depth on all of these. Unfortunately, time-wise, we have to move pretty quick. So, the second of